Okay, so today's script is going to be an, is a preview of an attempt to recreate the radial menu from Alien Isolation. So the idea being that you have little boxes and then depending on which way you move the cursor uh, you select one of these inventory items. So if we go ahead and run this version. You can see if I move in this box here we get this one highlighted and this one. Okay, and of course because we're in Max we have full customization so we can change how many slots there are. Let's just double the amount of slots. Uh, without respacing everything it might look a bit weird, but they're all there. So obviously when you uh, change how many slots you're using you want to make things smaller and maybe adjust the size out a bit as well just to balance it out okay so that's a little bit better you can see they're only slightly overlapping here now but of course everything's still working fine um, it, oh, and it automatically spaces them out correctly so if we even if we put 20 slots in we'll just move it down to say two eight okay <clears throat> and move it around you can see they're all still correct so one all the way around to 20 so obviously the buttons don't do anything right now but you can see the selecting so the selections are being hovered over correctly. So you, you can just add in, or I will just add in some form of basic inventory that you can select from here. Maybe changing weapons could do it for the basic weapons, one to nine on the weapon hot wheel perhaps. Uh, so if we change this down to say nine, and then we could have the size come in a bit, maybe 25 see how that looks with only nine okay that's not bad so you could use this and obviously the idea is that you don't have to use the mouse as well you could have the game um, controller select them based on which way you point the joystick is generally how it works in alien isolation to play my controller sort of just point the joystick in the right direction and it automatically stops on the correct one 